need someone to take my phone okay. for later. <laughs> Just. I promise. And don't do anything. <laughs> I swear to God. All right, well, uh, my name is Mitch. Uh, and for those of you who don't know me, I'm from England. No way. Or like I live there. <laughs> yeah, way. And I tell everyone that because I'm not interesting. And so like that's my way of being interested. And I lived there from when I was eight till I was 16. And in England, people like loved my American accent and they thought it was so cool. And I'd be like, I'm Mitch. They'd be like, you're from America. And I'd be like, why, well, yes, I am. But then like I come back here and I still have my American accent and I just like disappoint everyone because I say I'm from England and then they talk to me and I don't sound like it. I, like I'm robbing them of some experience. And so like this girl introduced me to her mom and she was like, oh, this is my friend Mitch. He's from England. And she was like, ooh, talk. <laughs> And I'm like, oh, like, I'm so sorry. Like, I, this is how I sound. I sound just like you. And she was like, oh, okay. <laughs> You're like a fully grown woman. I'm like 16 at the time. Because what she wanted to happen, what she wanted to be like, oh, this is my friend, but she's from England. She'd be like, ooh, talking. And be like, hello, how you doing? Why am I cleaning your chimney? But that didn't happen. You know, I, I robbed her that experience. I robbed her. I was like, you know, the people that hired Fergie to sing the national anthem, they just got robbed. Oh! oh. oh. Disappointment to her. I'm disappointed. Uh, speaking of being disappointment, I'm an actor. Uh, <laughs> thank you, thank you. You may have seen me in my latest work, crying in Starbucks. <laughs> <laughs> Latte for bread. Latte for bread. I'm getting a lot of buzz, a lot of Oscar buzz. Yeah. Oh wow, that was really good. Uh -huh. <laughs> And a part of like being an actor, uh, you do extra work. That's like a rite of passage into you know becoming an actual actor. And I've done a lot of extra work. I worked on this one film set, La Valantula. It's by the same people, by the same people that made Sharknado. You can all look this up later. Uh, if you're curious as to the science of a La Valantula, it's half tarantula. Half lava, <laughs> all garbage. And so, I'm, you know, I'm working on Lava Lanchula, and the director, the director thinks he's like so above this, and he hates it so much. You know, and so he's talking to us, and he's like, "Okay, guys, uh, so you're uh, you're gonna run out of the bar." Because there are lava lanchulas. <laughs> uh, there are lava lanchulas chasing you. You're gonna go left because the the lava lanchulas. Oh god. <laughs> they're they're corralling at the right. Uh, remember. Remember, they are tarantulas made out of lava. <laughs> lava lanchula. And so, but the thing, if you've ever done extra work, it's always in large groups. And the thing I realize about people is that people are idiots in large groups. And so the director's like, I want everyone to go left. And everyone's like, what? 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 And because like, somehow no one hears him. Except for like, the, the last thing he says, and I'm like, what happened? And everyone's like, like, oh, he said go right. They're like, oh no, I heard him go left. And like, I have to go straight. And I'm like, no, I have a watch on my left hand side. I think we should go left. And the director's like, you guys are all idiots. I, I can hear you all. I said go left. He's like, you're left, my right, left is right. And we're like, oh, you okay, got it. And then so we're all in the bar, and he's like, and. Lava Lanta! And we all start running out. And then, like, half go left and half go right. And like, Cat! Cat, what the hell did I just say? And someone from the right side, they go for it, like, Well, you said left is right, right? Which is a double positive, which makes it negative, which means right was right and left was wrong. And the director's like, No, no, that was right. Exactly! Like, No, 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 no. Left is the correct. Correct way to go. Oh, got it. Let's correct. Let's run. And so he's like, and Lava Latula! So everyone's going left, except for this one dude who starts like fighting the Lava Latula. Cut! Oh, what the hell are you doing, Rambo? He's like, these damn Lava Latulas killed my wife. <laughs> 
Do I really have to address this? Do I really have to? Okay, with the lava angelas that killed your wife are on the left. <laughs> okay, got it. And then like my, so we're all back in. And he's like, and lava angela. And then we're all start running out. Everything's going well, but then all of a sudden, do do dim dim do do dim dim. <laughs> Who's phone is that? And everyone's like, oh, somebody's in trouble. I'm like, yeah, you know it. <laughs> Slide in, turn it off. And he's like, who is that? And I, I got to fess up, so I put my hand on him. Like, and he's like, you know you're on a perfectly good lava angela shot. <laughs> Do you have anything to say for yourself? And I look, I'm like... Mind if I clean your chin, eh? Hey, yeah. yeah, a little tie in. No, uh, I have a little, I have another little bit for you. This is called uh, News Anchor Goes on a Blind Date. <laughs> Hi, my name is Brenna. You must be. Good evening, I'm Tom Haberdash, and here are tonight's top stories. I prove skeptics like my mother wrong by going on a real life date with a real life girl. Here to give us more, our on the scene reporter, Brenna. Brenna, how you doing tonight? Uh, not well. It, is this real life? Yes, it is. Now, Brenna, on a scale of 1 to 10, how's the day going so far? Uh, not well. I'm sorry. I'm gonna, oh, Brenna, gonna have to interrupt you there for some uh, breaking news. I'm calling off the date so I can tell my mother it was my idea to leave instead of yours. So we can back to our other field reporter, Brenna, to see how she likes the apples. Brenna, and she's gone. <laughs> sports, sports, how you doing? Uh, well, we lost tonight, bringing our losing streak to 16. All right, weather, how's the forecast looking? Uh, well, there's a 100% chance of crying and weeping into our pillow tonight, followed by a 60% chance of calling our freshman girl friend asking what's wrong with us. And if you look over here, over the next couple days, there'll be a large consumption of ice cream, some binge drinking, and a slight chance we watch the movie Love Actually, even though it's not Christmas. Terrific. Well, this is Tom Abernash and the crew signing off. Oh, on these cards, I'm also a magician! <laughs> on these cards are impressions. The phone that I gave to you, if you could hold it please, you are going to press uh, an activity. So, when you press an activity, you're going to read it out loud, and I'm going to read the impression off the card, and we're going to see what that person is doing. So, read the activity, I'll read the person, let's go for it. Rapping. Rapping? <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> you want to press the button again? No, I'm kidding. All right, so this is, uh, this is Miss Piggy rapping. <laughs> My name is Miss Piggy, and I'm here to say, I don't care, me. I don't care what you say. Okay. <laughs> next. All right, what's next? Playing hacky sack. Okay, Matthew McConaughey playing hacky sack. <laughs> Alright, alright, alright. <laughs> the more I hack, the more I sack. You know, you know. <laughs> oh, what is it? Shopping for produce. Shopping for produce. Okay, Rocky shopping for produce. Oh, right. uh, you know, I gotta go in there and I gotta get the meat. You know, once I get the meat, I gotta pound it with a knife. You know, I gotta go in there. Alright, what's next? Playing a harp. Playing a harp. Okay, this is Gilbert Gottfried <laughs> playing the harp. <laughs> This is such a beautiful instrument! It's so great! I love the sound of the heart! Okay, uh, uh, what's next? Skateboarding. Skateboarding, okay, Jerry Seinfeld skateboarding. Okay, people, okay, man, what's the deal? Who plays those wheels on this board? What's the deal with them? There are no brakes, that's so dangerous! Okay, what's next? Getting allergy shots. Getting allergy shots, okay, Jim Carrey getting allergy oh. shots. All right, Doc, stick me in. <laughs> oh, wait a second, do I smell a fire? It sure smells like one. Oh, wait, I don't think that was a fire. I think that was Jack Nicholson. <laughs> I, I can't believe he's about to give me a shot. Okay, what's next? <laughs> playing the accordion. Playing the accordion. A lot of instruments going on. Okay, uh, Kermit the Frog, playing the accordion. Uh, beep. Boop, bop, beep, boop. <laughs> oh, what's next? <laughs> butterfly, okay, Jay Leno, butterfly catching. So I saw, you know, the other day I was, uh, you know, I was uh, catching butterflies and, uh, you know, I caught it and uh, it's not a great joke. Oh, we have a great show if you done it. Oh, what's next? <laughs> picking apples. Picking apples, okay, Nicolas Cage picking apples. 
you take the apple and then you put it in the basket. Apple tree basket. Okay, what's next? Taking family photos, uh, Patrick Warburton, who plays Kronk from Emperor's New Groove, because you know that. <laughs> Say cheese. Okay. Uh, uh, what, what's next? Making cheese. Making cheese. John Wayne making cheese. <laughs> I can't believe I'm making cheese, Pilgrim. <laughs> that was butter, John Wayne. <laughs> Idiot. What's next? Dog training. Dog training, okay. Uh, Stewie Griffin. Brian, seat. Uh, 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 what's next? Go kart racing. Go kart racing. Christopher Walken, go kart racing. <laughs> wow. <laughs> you know, it's crazy. <laughs> Sitting in this car, it's wild. I drive all the time. Uh, it's so much more exciting. <laughs> right here. Uh, uh, what's that? Making a sandwich. Making a sandwich. Ian McKellen making a sandwich. Ian McKellen is Gandalf, in case you don't <laughs> So I put this bread and I put this lettuce together and I eat it as a you will pass! Uh, what's that? Train spotting. Train spotting. I don't know what that is, but Jimmy Stewart is train spotting. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, oh, kids, come here. There's, well, oh, 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 there's a trainer, and there's a trainer. <laughs> I'm just here spotting so many trains. <laughs> all right, uh, 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 is there one more? Cause I've I've been through all of them. Is there anyone anyone wants me to do one last request? Denzel Washington. Oh wow. <laughs> <laughs> that is that is heavy. Tracy I can't Morgan. do that. Tracy. Um, Tracy Morgan. Tracy, I can't do Tracy Morgan, <laughs> Sam. You know that. Yeah. <laughs> I'll do. You know, I'll do Jimmy Stewart one more time. That's my favorite. Whoop. One more Jimmy Stewart. Do Donald Trump for a test. Donald Trump? Yeah. Donald Trump. Okay. Uh, for what? Setting for a test. Donald Trump setting for a test. <laughs> <laughs> Never happened. Yeah. Never happened. All right. Okay. Donald Trump. Okay. Okay. Uh, Donald Trump. Okay. Okay. I got it. Okay. That's right. Okay. Yeah. I'll get it. It's perfect. Fantastic. I <laughs> no, maybe table. I study harder than anyone has ever studied. Before. I study longer. I, I, folks, folks, I'm the best studier I've ever met. I'm the best studier I've ever met. <laughs> <laughs>